fucking cha cha. I've never actually drove in KL before. <laughs> So we just move in today and still trying to settle down the documents, the keys, everything. So yeah, let me bring you around. Yep, this is the kitchen. This is the dining table. This is Chloe. This is the living room. And this is an extra space for us to I don't know do what, but we'll figure it out. Yeah, this is the first room. And this is the second room. Oh, this wow. nice. Roll now. This is the toilet. And this is the master bedroom. So we have a fancy view. From here you can go down straight to the lake and the facilities for yep. And we got toilet here. It's pretty cool. Looks like this. Yep, so I still have to let the agent know what's wrong And my socks is wet because it's leaking right here Look at that okay, This is the facility, this is the balcony Looking pretty good Champulut Thai sok bolo de bubut Hi everyone, so we're now at Nautica And this is the lobby And then what, um, there's like three blocks that is connected from this side I guess there's block A, then there's block B and block C. So this is the lobby where uh, from the security guard you just have to go right then turn and then you can get up here where you have like a mini fountain or something. Then yeah, then you have this table where people are supposed to uh, whenever they want to grab their food, they can leave their food here then come down afterwards. Then if you're like uh, buying something on Shopee or you have any parcel arrival, the person can put it into this pop box. It's called Lala Move. Then you just have to uh, key in the code, then you can get it. Just in case you're not at home or yeah. But if it's a big parcel, then we would recommend you being at home. Other than that, uh, the exterior is being really nice. And then uh, we'll bring you to the swimming pool. Then you have a multi-purpose court, like a multi-purpose hall where you can do badminton or maybe table tennis, is it? Yeah. Yeah, table tennis and then there is a restroom there. So we've seen a lot of people uh, using the multi-purpose court to play badminton, which is really, really nice. And if you're looking forward to live here, you'll actually notice there's a lot of, uh, how to say, uh, lo locals, but like foreigners. Local and foreigners. Yeah, locals and foreigners and there's also students living here because it's very very close to schools. So here you have a seating lawn and it's open air, uh, which is kind of sad because when it's like raining, you can't sit here because it gets wet. But uh, it's a nice open air. We have a tunnel kind of thing and we got you have your weight room. The facilities here are not really really a lot but for me and Vincent it's actually enough for us because as you can see here the pool is so so nice and um, this place is very very convenient let's say if you have a car or maybe you don't have a car you can just walk through the grocery store which is Sunway Geo so living here is really really convenient and for us um, the experience here so far is that the security guards, the management is really good. Like uh, you have 24 hour security and whatever someone wants to go into the security to this lobby, they would have to register themselves through their driving license. Yeah, so the pool is also very very clean, not your typical swimming pool that has a lot of chlorine, but this one is very very clean as you can see here. For your swimming pool, you also have a jacuzzi area. So initially, we were like wondering why is there three pools? But yeah, we figured out this is actually a jacuzzi where you actually have to press this button there, then it will start bubbling. Wait, let me show you. Oops. And 
almost every day you can see a lot of people swimming here so for block b there's another entrance here that you can come straight out to the pool and then you have other facilities too that we'll get into it later so the view here is actually a lakeside view very very pretty as you can see there yep then there's construction going on but uh being being able to swim and then at the edge you could see the view is so great we went for a night swim the other day and it was very very pretty the city view the night view and it's not blocked by any buildings because um in front there there are actually landed house like bungalows uh, semi-detached so you can tell that there's no building that is going to be built right here that is going to block your view yep so they actually made seating areas too for um, the parents who are guarding their children or you want to put your things then here you have another tunnel and then going into the playground not exactly a playground i would say it's kind of like extreme because there is a lot of rules and what are you supposed to do with me or like you stand on them and then you climb up and it leads to a basket like that can sit on this thing then you swing but it just rained just now so it's kind of wet here yeah so I'm not gonna sit on this but yep looks like that then you have this climbing thing which I don't know where you're supposed to climb to but yeah oops then you have some rock climbing things going on and that's actually for about it for the playground then you also have your local gym. The gym is quite nice. Uh, it's not exactly that big, big, but it's fully equipped, I would say, right? Yeah. yeah. It is. Like, quite sufficient. Mm, quite sufficient. Like, you, mm. can, you can do your full body. You can do your arms, you can do your back, you can do your legs. Yeah, they are really, really sufficient. You have uh, the jogging track. Jogging track. No, you have the running jogging machine, and then the cycling machine, and you have a lot of dumbbells. Yeah, it's. Very, very good. And we have another tunnel here. There's a lot of rock of tunnels. So to use all the swimming pools or like the gym, you have to register with the security guard, which is at the end of the block, which is block C. So here is block C. So it's not very far from the swimming pool too. So each block has their own um, benefits, I would say. Like block A, you're very, very close to the lobby, so you don't have to walk so far. For block C, you're very close to the gym and the swimming pool. For block B, you're just in the middle of everything, which you have to walk in place. So here you have a convenience store too. We actually went down here to buy this, uh, our house stuff for quite a lot of time. Um, and it's very, very convenient. And the price is not like very, very expensive. It's just cheap and just right. Maybe like around 10 cents different, which is not much. Then you have an, uh, uh, yeah. You have a cleaning. Yeah, if you need any cleanings for your house, then you also have to provide the service. Then this is the laundry uh, service area, where if you need any uh, big cleanings, you don't have a big washing machine to clean your sheets, you can actually put it here. So there's a game room here also. So there's a pool table, there's uh, the football thingy thingy that you could do. Then there's seating lounge. And if you want to work in there, you actually can too, because they provide tables. Yep. And we've seen a lot of people working in there, although they are residents here. Because sometimes your house just gives you a homey feel. But uh, for this, you can come here work and it feels like an office. Uh, so you have another machine like this, which we don't know what is it called, which is uh, whatever you can buy. You know, the whole money they keep yeah, 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 yeah. There's like drinks, and then they fill it up quite often, so you don't only have like soya bean or whatever, but you have different different type of things, and there's two of them. So if you need any grab snacks, then you could go for it, and it's not that expensive too, just a typical one. Then you also have a reading room where uh, you can do this as your office too. You can come down here for your office. So there's a lot of residents like coming to teach their child. For this, you can bring your kids or you want to study here. Yep, you can do too or you want to work here. Yeah. So that's all that we have for you for our Nautica tour. And uh, yeah, I hope you like it. And we will be packing and going to IKEA to get some house appliances and stuff. Yep.
Where are we right now? Ikea. <laughs> Why are you bucking cha cha? He did not stress out with that stress, man. small car, also cannot park straight. I've never actually drove in KL before, like literally. So, so it's, it's very, very stressful. Kind of scary for him. So, first we gotta scan the Mice Jathra because um, so we know like who's going in and stuff. And. Then you show the card and then you say hello. Look at him so chill. Because I said hi to him just now, and he's like, yeah. the point is, he asked for extra, extra camera. <laughs> Chloe Jing Chong Ling Long, where are you? Hello! We are at IKEA. So do you say it as IKEA or IKEA? You should be IKEA, right? IKEA. I have no idea. Everyone says it differently. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yep, so we bought quite a bit of stuff, but we're gonna come back next time again. Yeah, because there's things that is not available right now, they're out of stock. And uh, which is, what is it that is not available that you're very sad of? Uh, table X. We got a drawer, we got a tabletop, but no X, so yeah, that's sad. So we'll come back next time to get our studio sorted out. Mm -hmm. So today, just uh, buying a bit of Mostly house. actually kitchenware, a lot of kitchenware. Yeah. Like for the containers, and then we bought a jug. We're not actually sure if we could uh, film here. I don't know. The guy said no camera yeah, so Yeah, just now the guy said no camera So we didn't actually film all the way So you could see just now in front it was suddenly a stop But anyways, here we are yeah, we bought all of the And stuff. we bought all of the stuff Yeah, we're gonna make a series of how we change a rental property Into, into a, li not livable but a comfy home I yeah, guess Yeah, but we won't change much of it since we're living our contract is for one year, so if we're changing like the whole thing, then it's not quite worth it. Yeah, so if you are renting your own unit as well, so you can follow along, so you can know how do we uh, use what exists in your unit and then just add on whatever you actually need. Something that might help to boost up your aesthetic or practicality kind of stuff. Yep, so how's your it session today? It very, very fun because back in Kota Kinabalu, we don't have uh, IKEA. Yes, But indeed. now we're in Kuala Lumpur, there is IKEA. And the drive from our place to IKEA is actually not that far, but not that close either. Mm -hmm. About a 20 to 30 minutes drive, but it was a straight road drive. So how was your experience driving on the road? <laughs> uh, it was pretty stressed out. Yeah, because we don't oftenly drive in the city area. It's like not big city. Yeah, big, big city. city. We live like in kind of a city too, but not as city as yes. big as yeah. Yeah, Kuala Lumpur. Lumpur. It was great experience. Yeah, we're gonna check out some of other furnitures and we're gonna get a bill done and we yep. have to head home real soon. Yeah, because yep. there's the... Some renovation for our fan at 3 o'clock, so it's so symmetry. Let's take some photos.